Hey everyone, welcome back. You've heard a lot about my journey, but today I want to introduce you to a lot of the other people who we've met on board and their particular reasons and their particular backstories and some of the things they do. I hope you enjoy. We'll start with Derek, who is from South Africa by way of New Zealand. Say hi, Derek. I'm filming. Hi people, how you doing? There we go, cool. Derek is the electrician on board the YWAM PNG and has been a huge help. He has taught me a great deal about the intricacies of the vessel. He has been striving to do mission work for a long time and cites his deep-rooted faith as the reason for pursuing it. I thought, well, I'll come with the Y1 PNG for uh, a couple of outreaches just to, uh, while I wait for my reply back from the I applied at my uh, sample suit training school. I uh, wanted to go into full-time missions. Yeah, I was uh, raised in a Christian family. Mm -hmm. My grandparents and my sons were Christians. And now let me introduce Amos, our engine cadet. Uh, who are you? <laughs> hey, what's, where are you from? Uh, East New Britain. East New Britain? Yeah. Very nice. East New Britain. There's a new Britain, everybody. A lot better than the old one. And you're an engine cadet? Yeah. Do you like working in the engine room? Yeah. Nice. Do you like working with me? Yeah. Liar. <laughs> Liar. <laughs> Alright, so, it's all the world out there. This is where shower water goes on YMM PNG. And by the smell of this space we're in, apparently people are peeing in the shower. Yeah, that's what I want to pee in there. <laughs> oh, that's the chief engineer over there. Hey, yeah. chief. But the smell in this place is, it's, it's rather strong. <laughs> we're just clearing it out, making sure everything works. Also joining the ship is Corette. She represents Days for Girls which, believe it or not, is an organization that provides kits to young women in secluded areas, and with these kits, they are enabled to make their own feminine hygiene products. It's not a topic that gets a lot of notice as a big issue, but lack of these products while menstruating can lead young women to not go to school or even leave the house at all. Having her and all the representatives of Days for Girls on board is another way YWAM is helping the community. A few days ago, we were joined by 10 Israelis, which made for a good bit of fun. At the Israeli table, they are five doctors, three nurses, one midwife specializing in home birth, and a reporter from an Israeli newspaper. This outreach, the YWAM PNG will have 122 souls aboard from 19 different countries, and 20% of the crew is from Papua New Guinea, which is a great thing. All right, that's it for today. Thank you very much for stopping in as always. Have a good day and a great weekend, and I'll talk to you guys soon. See ya.